Welcome back to Football News Center. Today, we're diving into the African Cup of Nations and discussing the impact of Mohamed Salah on the tournament. Is he really a hero for the whole of Africa? The teams in Group A and B of Afghan are currently stationed in the plateau area of Abidjan, Ivory Coast. Despite the pressure on Nigeria and Ghana, the mood at the hotel they're sharing is surprisingly buoyant. However, some commentators believe that these teams may exit the tournament before the knockout stages. Nigeria has a talented group of centre-forwards, but there seems to be a lack of partnerships further back. Some players feel that their coach, Jose Pesairo, overthinks his plans instead of letting the team play freely. On the other hand, confidence in Ghana is at an all-time low. The country's federation is blamed for failing to develop an infrastructure that produces quality players. Many believe that Ghana's hopes rest solely on the performance of Mohamed Kudus, the West Ham United forward. The atmosphere in Abidjan is tense, especially near the Felix Hoop Howitt Boini Stadium where Egypt made their entrance into the competition with a frustrating 2-2 draw against Mozambique. The game was only secured in injury time with a contentious penalty kick from Liverpool's Mohamed Salah. Salah is the leader of the Egyptian team and is considered one of the best players in the country's history. However, he faces the pressure of delivering a victory in Afghan, which has been the one big hole in his glittering career. While Egypt has a rich history in the tournament, winning it multiple times, Salah has yet to lift the trophy. Salah's impact goes beyond the football pitch. He is the first Egyptian footballer to become a corporate machine, appealing to fans worldwide. His goals have led Egypt to their third World Cup appearance in 2018, but Afghan holds greater meaning for the country. Winning this tournament could change the way people perceive Salah and solidify his place as a legend in Egyptian football. But how does the rest of Africa feel about Salah? While his civic actions have been handled discreetly, he is highly regarded by fans across the continent. In the vastness of Africa, cultural alignments and race play a significant role. Egyptian identity is often debated, with suggestions that it is more Arab by culture than African. However, Salah's popularity transcends these boundaries, making him a beloved figure throughout Africa. As the tournament progresses, Salah aims to avoid the same caveats faced by other football legends. Despite the pressure, he remains determined to lead Egypt to victory and cement his legacy as a hero for not only Egypt but the whole of Africa. That's all for today's episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Football News Center for more updates on the African Cup of Nations. Until next time, keep enjoying the beautiful game.